Well, Daniel, where to start with that one? Some night that, wasn't it? Proper party in the uh, in the stadium. So uh, you told me that there is even another gear. I was always excited about what our supports are doing, but everyone told me there's another gear. I mentioned before, so t today would be a good good day uh, to find this gear. And yeah, stadium was was crazy buzzing. So my lad showed a big big heart today and and fought really hard against a really good side uh, to to have the three points. But in the end, we deserved this uh, over 90 minutes and also with our big will. And and uh, yeah, it will be a proper weekend for all supporters. That's definitely for sure. <laughs> Starting fairly soon, I would imagine. In that second half, there were times, though, when when the team was hanging on a little bit. Leicester played some really good stuff, didn't they? Yes, but this is also what you would expect on this level. It was more or less a, a game on, on Premier League level. Between two really good sides, I think they were very lucky to be in lead uh, at half-time because uh, our intensity against the ball was good. We created really good chances. We should have scored Joel with a chance. Either he has to put it away or pass the ball to Kui. A ball, uh, he puts it then in, into an empty net. Really with a chance. Also Joel with his header normally on, uh, on a game... Uh, with such a level, you have to score out of this situation. And uh, yeah, they were able to, to score out of a, a flicked uh, set piece. This was the difference. I think they were lucky to be in lead. Um, then we had to really to dig in for, for 20 minutes. And we were then a bit lucky not to concede the second goal. But you also have to survive such periods on, in such a game and show big heart to fight your way back into the game. And I think in the f last 15, 20 minutes, again, we were fantastic and wanted to have this uh, win. Even the goals were, were goals of will and intensity and win the ball back and win the offensive duel um, so it was uh, was um, yeah it was unbelievable energy and in, uh, intensity of my my lads they showed big big fighting spirit and togetherness exactly what Leeds United is, uh, is all about and for that I think we deserve to have the three points and uh, yeah if you do this and like I mentioned you can have a proper party <laughs> I think as the season progresses the character of the side is really coming to the fore we had to show a lot of character but the twelfth men. I mean, the, the crowd. They were everywhere. Was going absolutely crazy. They need something to feed off of. They certainly help the team as well. Yes, obviously. So I think we give uh, them a lot to cheer about at the at the moment. So with win after win, and also with great performances, and uh, right now also with great fighting spirit. And and uh, this is what this club is all about. If you show unity and togetherness and and fighting spirit, then Leeds United can be successful. But you have to be united, and this is what we are as a group with players. The the group is with our staff within the whole club, and uh, yeah, our biggest asset and biggest value of of uh, of our club are our supporters. There's Second to none, in this, uh, in this um, 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 even in this, in the whole country, and I have to say, I'm pretty, pretty happy for them and delighted for them that after really two years of, of difficulties and and suffering, they are capable right now to to enjoy such a uh, really good period, such a successful period with proper football and also proper fighting spirit and unity, and uh, they definitely deserve uh, to to enjoy this feeling. You praise the players, but we're going to praise the manager because your substitutions were excellent and made a big difference didn't they in that second half yes but uh, um I'm, I'm there in order in order to to help my players uh, we had also a period when i got the feeling no we just have to um to stay in the game and and uh, then when i got the feeling okay right now we have to change a bit you can have an idea that you bring uh, Connor uh, Roberts in because I got the feeling so he's always there with end products either with an assist or with a goal and in this game I trusted also Archie to play on the left uh, fullback position he never played there um, it was obviously risky because he's never played there there before and um, yes it's nice to get compliments as a manager but I want to give the compliments uh, further on and back to my to my players because how Archie fulfilled my idea how mm -hmm. Connor fulfilled my, my, my vision that he could have a big uh, big impact this is important and for that all the praise goes uh, for me to the players not to the manager